Hello, oh, by the way, my name is David. I'm the founder of Artisan Revere. Uh, Justin commissioned a couple of knives for you, and uh, here they are. I'm gonna do our standard QC inspection for you. Um, and uh, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. I'll give you my phone number at the end. Um, so first thing I'm gonna do is um, cut through some magazine paper, just to show you just how sharp these knives are. That was your small petty knife. This is your paring knife. Beautiful, sharp, I can hear the grittiness of the edge, which is uh, what I like. I want the edge to be nice and toothy. Um, I'm gonna do a, another check on the edge at the end. So first things first, let's uh, inspect the uh, pins, make sure they're nice and flush with the handle. They are, now I'm gonna check the handle to make sure it's really soft. Uh, I'm checking the blue rich light, uh, yeah, blue rich light, the red G10 in the tank to make sure there's no gaps between them, there aren't any. I'm feeling the uh, handle at the very front to make sure it's nice and soft, it is. We're gonna check this area right here that's called the choil. We want that nice and soft and smooth and rounded so you're comfortable. Same thing for the spine of the blade, that's beautiful as well. Now I'm gonna inspect the edge grind. Make sure it's nice and even and this is that additional check on the edge that I just mentioned running into my fingernail. I'm gonna do the exact same thing on the paring knife. Not gonna say everything out loud though. And let's check the edge, beautiful. Okay, these are both fantastic knives. Uh, just a couple quick pointers. If you're storing them on a magnet, make sure you put, let's pretend this is a magnet, uh, make sure you put the spine of the blade onto the magnet first and then rotate it. And then to remove, remove the edge and then rotate it and then pull it off. Um, and then um, the other way to store, and we recommend both, is to put it in the leather sheath. So when you're doing that, make sure you match up the AR on the knife and the AR on the sheath. It's gonna do two things. Number one, it's gonna create some friction so it's not gonna fall out. Number two, uh, you have an extra leather welt on the bottom of the, uh, the sheath and that's gonna prevent you from cutting through. You can store this upside down, but you have no friction and there's no welt on the top of the, uh, the leather sheath. Um, another thing, it's always good to have a, a little rag with food grade mineral oil infused in it. Um, I use this uh, regularly, especially on the handle materials. It's gonna make sure that the handles look really, really rich. Um, before I ship these out, I'm going to clean them up, re-oil them, and uh, get them out to you. And as promised, uh, if, you need, if you have any questions and if you need to reach out, please don't hesitate to, to do so. Uh, my cell is 386-986-9649. Thanks so much. Enjoy your new knives.